It's Time Warner Cable's local edition. I'm Brad Pomerant. Sebastian Ridley Thomas is back, a member of the California State Assembly. He is the chair of the Elections Committee in the California State Assembly, of course. I want to speak with you about voter turnout. We are both Angelinos, yes. and as you know, we recently had a city council election with turnout that really could only be described as abysmal. But there was a silver lining, I guess you could say, uh, to initiative passed, which will be moving the city elections, the, some school district elections, to even number of years. What do you make of it, sir? Well, I think it's a unique opportunity to re-engage voters uh, all at one time when they're looking at presidential and gubernatorial elections, state assembly, state senate, and congressional right. elections. Uh, you uh, raise the voter IQ and you avoid voter fatigue mm -hmm. uh, in many ways. You also uh, incentivize uh, campaigns to really focus clearly on uh, a broader section of voters. I wish eventually they'll adjust campaign finance limits so that we can that's, raise the resources to do right, so. Right, that's a conversation. But if you can say vote, and that means twice, every two years in June and in November, it's much easier to communicate to voters and mobilize more voters to do so. Were you surprised by the margin with which those two initiatives passed? Pleasantly surprised because I think it's an acknowledgement of those voters who are the core mm -hmm. in terms of the electorate who never miss an election, haven't missed it in 20 or 30 right. years, the stablest, most reliable voters, or rather the most stable and reliable mm -hmm. voters, have said we need greater participation. It was not a cynical electorate. It was an inclusive and broad electorate. It did pass, but did what pass. about those that are concerned that with city council races being on the same ballot as president, as senate, as governor, as the other statewide constitutionals, as the assembly and the senate of the congress, city council will get lost. No, it's just as important. And um, honestly, local government is where the rubber meets the road. The supervisorial elections right. are not lost right. because they are significant, they are important, we get good coverage. Mm -hmm. Uh, journalists like yourself uh, who right. uh, get the civic uh, participation uh, and mm. civic dialogue conversation will not let it go. Sometimes you'll remind your you know listeners it. over and over always. again, vote, 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 do. vote early, vote often, exactly. vote as often as you can. Exactly. We want to make that argument more simple. And it's our responsibility from a governmental perspective to be as clear, as direct, and as inclusive as we can. And moving the elections to even number of years does that. I believe that recently you and State Senator Ben Allen, who heads up the Senate Elections Committee, had a forum in Los Angeles. Is we that did, right? about low voter turnout. Right. The big issue being that, so LA has this, LA County has low turnout, but we also have a number of cities that have off-year elections. Right. So it's mis-messaging. Mm -hmm. So the core voters are confused, even the core voters. So the occasional voters and the the folks that vote once in a blue moon, right. once every presidential, they voted for Barack Obama right. in the primary right. in 2008. And that's the last time we saw them. And that's the last time they saw them, and they don't mm -hmm. remember how to vote. Right. That becomes much more difficult. So what are you doing in Sacramento? What is Mr. Allen doing in Sacramento? We're undertaking a conversation about making it easier to vote, allowing the county register and county boards of supervisors to prioritize local races at a higher pace than they are because right now they would be behind judges so we want to see that be well, able to move up like the mayor and city council right. and the citywide officers and, ball and city ballot measures go higher mm -hmm. on the ballot as opposed what to the ballot. What about the, the number of elections, all the special elections that we're forced to endure? So, so, so certainly are consider reforming that process and uh, it, it will take a vote of the people of the state to formally reform how mm -hmm. we pick senators and assembly people state senators and assembly people. We also are looking at vote centers as opposed to polling precincts, where, where your ballot, you can bring right. it in regardless of where you live and deposit it there. You'll come back? I certainly shall. He is Sebastian Ridley Thomas, member of the California State Assembly. I'm Brad Pomerantz. It's Time Warner Cable's Local Edition.